What's up guys, how you all doing? I'm Paul the Tech Giant. Welcome back to the channel where tonight I want to talk to you about the latest software update for the 2022 LG C2, G2 and CS OLEDs. So let's first take a look at what this new software version number is then. So holding down on the settings button on the remote control. And if we go down to support and software update, now I'm doing this on the brand new LG CS OLED. For anyone who is interested, this is the 55 inch version. And the new software version number is 03.21.30. And that is coming from the previous software version, which was 03.20.95. Now, I know a lot of people have been picking up new LG OLEDs over the past few days, particularly this new LG CS OLED. So uh, just a top tip if you are tuning in for the first time, I would highly recommend if your TV out of the box has auto update tick to on, I would recommend taking that off because uh, we have had some dodgy updates in the past and if that is turned on, the TV will automatically download and install any updates that are available and that might not be the best thing. Okay, heading on over to LG's UK site now then, and we've put in our model number, and as we can see there, the OLED 65 CS. And uh, as I said earlier, it does also apply to the C2 and G2 OLEDs. So if we head on down to a reference, and we can see the software version number there, 032130, and it says improvement fixing minor bugs in software yet again so once again lg are letting us play the guessing game at exactly what those minor bugs are that they are fixing so what are my thoughts on this update well i have been running the update on both my lg c2 oled and on this brand new lg cs oled and I'm happy to report that I've not found anything negative to complain about. Now, I have had a few people come forward saying that they had an issue when they've done this update where the time and date had reset and they had to go in and put it back to sort of the automatic time and date setting. I personally have not experienced that. So uh, maybe if you do the update, might be worth just checking that the time and date is correct. So if you have recently picked up an LG OLED TV from 2022, then I would say, yeah, you are good to go ahead and do this update. Now, just a quick shameless plug, if you're looking to purchase a new TV or anything electrical from the UK, please consider using in my box affiliate link because any purchase that you make puts a few pennies back in my pocket and I really appreciate all you guys out there who have already used it. Now if you have enjoyed today's video do us a favour and give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you already haven't for more update videos like this in the future and hopefully I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye for now.